Are you guys ready for all kinds of games, right? Ready? There's picture number one, picture number two, picture number three, number four, number five, seven. Oh, yeah. Surprising. This is very surprising. I gotta show you guys. My experience so far for thieving, as you guys can see on the right side of the screen, I'm getting 202k thieving an hour so far, and there is level 82 thieving. Giggity, giggity, do, 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 nothing 82. But um, yeah, I've gotten 202k thieving experience an hour uh, on average for the past about 35 minutes. So I've done about 120k thieving experience, which seems to be quite a bit of time, I guess. So you can roughly estimate that this uh, level 81 plus thieving area is around 200k an hour. I, I used to think it was like around 180 and like 91 plus was like 220 to like 240 or some shit. But looks like I'm getting 200 here. Although I must say I've had pretty lucky runs lately as well. But I mean, I've done like 10 plus runs almost and gotten... Good on all. Oh, man, I also got an effigy. But yeah, so a little update on the stats now, guys. 77 fishing. I just got that recently. I did a little bit of fishing uh, for the past day or so. I got about 400k fishing experience. And now I'm just doing a little bit of pure plunder. I'm going to probably go back to fishing for now and just focus a little more on my EOC account. I'm doing a few things on there right now. i got to open my effigy as well pretty soon before I uh, fucking keep sitting here and wasting experience. As you guys know, if you already have one effigy, um, the ratio of getting the next one is a lot lower than like getting one. It's, it's a lower drop rate. I guess you can... No, 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 no. I need the fucking dis disease, disease. There we go. Good. For right now, though, probably going to go back to uh, cooking, actually, not uh, not fishing. Because, as you guys know, not too far from level 99, I kind of just want to bang this out as soon as I can. So I don't have to worry about fishing anymore. Sell all my raw sharks. And when I think I have a little, I think I'm a little bit shy of having 99 banked. I think that's obviously a little more than uh, 15k uh, sharks. It's a little bit more, I believe, just a tiny... Actually, maybe it's not. I think I think I might have just enough. There's 210 experience each, I believe, not 200. So, yeah, I might I might have perfect. Next clip will be all kinds of gains. Dun na 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 na. Yep, that's right. 21 hunter. I've been using as many lamps as I possibly have been getting on hunter lately. Um, just because, obviously, like I said before, it is by far the slowest skill in the world whenever it's a low level. Once you get higher levels up, obviously, it's a lot easier. But, like, it's it, it's, not, it's honestly crazy how slow Hunter is compared to other skills when you're such a low level. Because, like, one fucking trap, like, one thing you can catch, it's just horrible. Anyways, aside from that, guys, yes, I did, go, I did do some mining basically right now. I am actually not too far from level 69. I am, yeah, about 9k experience till... Thank God this shit has been boring. I've been sitting here for an hour and how long has it been? It's been so far. I'm getting 39k an hour because it's nighttime and the worlds are kind of dying right now. Uh, but since I'm kind of just watching movies and shit, I don't really pay too much attention to the actual experience per hour. If you do, uh, As always, if you guys look at the experience per hour, especially on a skill like mining or room crafting, you will never want to do this skill. But yeah, as you guys can see right here, um, 39k an hour. I've done 54k mining. I have not left this spot yet. I just want to wait till I get my level and then one more time I will come here and get uh fucking hate these imps these imps always fly literally right in between the fucking rocks it's so fucking annoying oh a little update on EOC I'm actually now camping here for a little while it's a little bit faster for defense experience per hour um I figure I might as well not do too much range experience uh while I'm camping those things just because I will get some range experience from doing slayer and normally whenever I uh, I do tasks in the slayer tower and you do the slayer contract thing I normally use the experience on range uh, which adds up over time. I mean, you, you do like 10 tasks in the Slayer Tower. It comes out to like 200k range plus experience. Anyways, I'll see you guys next clip with 69 mining. Bum, da 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 Another four hours to go. And boom, there it is, guys. 70 mining. Uh, but I was doing mining for uh, quite a while. About 58k experience as well. Sitting down that time at 40k. Now, it wasn't the fastest spawn world, but goddamn. And this picture here happened a few days ago. I got level 20 Hunter. Uh, I was doing a little Slayer on my stream, so I, yeah, I just got that. But um, yeah, I've been using a lot of my uh, my things on my bonus lamp thingies from the randoms on Hunter. I'm now level 80, now level 22, not 82. I fucking wish I was 82. I'd be fucking close to the top page, I think, on that point. But anyways, level 22, I have um, not too far from level 23, actually. I believe at level 27, I'm supposed to go catch ferrets until, I think, I'm going to try Swamp Lizards. I remember those things being pretty damn good. I know Hunter starts to pick up once you can at least do three traps, and then obviously four, and it gets up to five, obviously. But, um, yeah, so hopefully that'll happen soon, but I'm just going to wait a little bit for that. Uh, Fishing-wise, not too far from 79. I've just been sitting here for the past, like, two hours just kind of fishing and just relaxing. 
Uh, but I'm thinking I might do some Hunter pretty soon. Kind of feeling like uh, I gotta get 30 as soon as I can. I got um, if you guys know how to check, by the way. Uh, if you just click on the quest after you're done, I think I already talked about this, but yeah, it basically just says another two days I can do this. Um, I basically just realized now that once you are, I had a friend tell me this as well, once you are level 30, you get 60 experience per point you get in that game. Uh, I think I got 120 last time in Tears of Gothic, so that would have been like 7.2k fucking Hunter experience. And instead, if you're underneath 30, you get like 26.6, so it's literally less than half. Um, so yeah, hopefully once I, the next time that happens, which is, I still have two days obviously to get level 30 hunter. I got level 30 hunter, then from level 30 I could probably get to like level like 34, 35, just from doing the, uh, the, the tiers of Guthix just for one time. But yeah, 1887 total so far. Uh, I got 72 agility as well. My, my, I was recording actually a video to do a talk over, and as I got, I saw myself get level 72 agility. So you guys will see that in a future video soon, where I kind of just move my screen over because I got 72 agility. Uh, but that's not too bad. 70 to 71, mostly from like one or two quests, and the rest all from fishing, uh, which ain't too bad. I was gonna do a little bit more fishing and then probably go do a little bit of Hunter and hopefully get around all the 30 sometime tonight. I just wanna fucking finish off Hunter. Uh, not 99, obviously, but just get 70 ish, maybe even 80 in the future because it is a fast skill. It's just that I fucking hate training it. Um, and then I'll be somewhat close to 2K total. I'd say 2000, like probably 2020 total. That'll be around the top page whenever I am around there. Right now it's like 212 or some shit. I assume it'll be around 220 once I actually get there. Or not 220, 20, 20 yeah, 2020. <laughs> Hit games!